Welcome back to Mother 3. Last time, we finally entered the Empire Porky building after taking on Facade. And played with DCMC for a while until it got cut off abruptly. This time, we're continuing our trek up the Empire Porky building. The chain of command is so screwed up. What the Pigmaster is supposed to be doing, what we're supposed to be doing, it's such a big mess. This isn't gonna work out. Doesn't it seem that way for, from your point of view too? Yeah. Pretty unprofessional. It's all because of those lousy intruders that the DCMC concert got stopped. We DCMC fans ought to catch them ourselves and make them pay. Urgh. Uh. Maybe the boss is in a prickly mood because some of the horns on his head. <laughs> the boss is in a real prickly mood. Um, I already talked to you. I guess there's no chance of them starting the concert over, huh? The man would stand next to me on hands. While I was flaying around during the blackout, I think our li lips touched. I I wonder if it was on purpose. Do, 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 do you suppose that hit? He, he li likes me. Oh, my heart's beating so fast. The woman next to me, I'm holding hands with. When I was flaying around during the blackout, I think our lips t t touched. I I wonder if it was on purpose. Do, 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 do you suppose that she li likes me? Oh, my heart's beating so fast. You have anything to say? Whenever there's a blackout or everything is dark is when I feel the most relaxed. Even with the power out, the elevator still works. Does it have a different power source? Hmm. I guess we're going up. Next stop, 100th floor. Hmm. This is the wonderful hippo pool. Here you can swim with hippo launchers, gaze at hippo launchers, and observe hippo launchers eating. You can even fight them. Oh, what? What was that? That's dangerous though. No. Oh. Advised, advised. This room's temperature and humidity are displayed here. That's all. Up, oh, you need something? Yeah, let's uh, let's save here really quick. Please be careful out there. Give my regards to the next frog you meet. Hippo launchers. Hippotomy. <laughs> Hippopotomy. <laughs> Hippopotami, dang it. That have been fancied up and equipped with powerful missiles. Incredibly pow popular, even among women and senior citizens. Improvements to create household pet versions are currently underway. I I'd have one. So, these hippo launchers, as you can infer... Okay, we're fine. Uh, as you can infer, these hippo launchers are en enemies. Oh man, wasn't able to do it. These guys are freaking dangerous. I recommend unloading your strongest attacks on them. And, if you can, get Duster to Siren Beetle them before they can uh, get an attack out on you. Because these guys, they're tough. They have a lot of HP, and they're very uh, and they're very high attack as well. So I recommend actually just doing what I am doing right now. And, if you can, get Duster to Wall Staple them while they're turned around. See if that works. Ah, uh, it didn't work. Just keep on loading. Oh gosh. <laughs> Not a good sign. All right, we were able to beat it. Make sure you get its back sprite. These things have a 1 in 33 chance of dropping uh, dropping a very special item that is very, very helpful. It's one of the final equips, in my opinion. There's no official final equips, but I do find that this one, in particular, is quite helpful, and I am here to help you get the best possible outcome you can throughout this game. So... I am going to cut around until we get it, because we have to get three of them. We have to get one for Lucas, Komatora, and Duster, whatever it is. So I will be cutting to when I get each one. I will see you guys soon. Oh, and Lucas learns Healing Omega. No, oh, Komatora learns Thunder Omega, awesome. And Lucas learned Refresh. Okay, this is interesting. Um, refresh is basically... This is... I'll let the PSI menu explain it. Uh, refresh, where are you? 
Is it up here? There it is. Slowly restores all HP, all allies HP each turn. It's It works slowly, but it is good. I end up finding, if you're gonna use a healing item in which, uh, or a healing power spell uh, in which you're trying to heal everybody, I find that Life of Omega works a bit better, but it's not the worst thing in the world. It's uh, It can be pretty helpful. Oh, shoot. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, I have been at this for a while and just want to show you guys that Lucas is level 61. 61, 60, 61. This is debatably the greatest, most useful, uh, most useful PSI move in the entire series. Show it. It's like a five hit combo of like one of your strongest what um one of your strongest things, you know? It's great. I like it quite a bit. But we'll get more into it later. Oh my gosh. Oh, finally. Oh. Uh, yes. Yes, I will. I'll throw away the secret herb. Uh goodness. Because healing, uh healing omega which we have can actually I'm a little stunned. I was doing that for like, <laughs> who knows how long. And that was just the first one because we need to get two more of these. What level? Goodness, 63. Like, like, look at look at how long I've been doing this here. Um, but healing Omega, goodness, has been. Healing Omega can actually revive party members. So keep that in mind. Um, Luke's is. Not the Libra bracelet, the pumice charm. We are going to reply ace with the thud charm, which, as you can see, better, not mega different, and not to mention, uh, you can very much beat the game without these. But I like to have them, so I am going to go for the other two. I'll see you in a minute or several. Oh, finally, okay, great, thud charm. Um, I'm going to have Kumatora, I think. Put on this one. All right, that's two down, one to go. Here are the stats now. Ugh, goodness. Okay, that one didn't take as long. That one was probably like five minutes later. Okay, cool. Thud charm, good. Uh, I'm actually gonna go into the goods and drop all these pumice charms. There's no real reason to hold on to them in hopes of selling them or anything. Past that point. Uh, pumice charm, where are you? And we're going to drop that. Very good. Ugh, finally. Let's head, let's head out. There are some more right here. They won't bother you, though, if you leave them to their devices. A super bomb. Okay, cool. Get over here. What are you up to? I want to do research so bad. I want to research more and more and more. If only I had research funding, I could improve the hippo launchers even more and more. Would you like to know how I'd improve them? Sure. I'd make it so hippo launchers can brush their teeth on their own, go to the bathroom at night before bed, and fetch the newspaper. You know, those kinds of improvements. Meh. Maybe for you. <laughs> Sounds like they kind of get the raw end of the deal. <laughs> okay. It appears that you guys appear to be suspicious guys. I, I, I'll be drop guard. Go, 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 go get him, my hippo launcher. All right, this is the one uh, hippo launcher you're actually required to fight, actually. Uh, so we'll use PK ground on it, why not? Just get things through a little bit. Sorry, that was my chair. Um, I need to heal also, I just remembered. <laughs> Totally forgot. Oh, that wasn't overly effective on this, actually. That was weird. Alrighty. Not bad at all. Ah, my hippo launcher. Curse you, you'll pay for this. Believe you me. Stupid heads. Believe you me. I've had it. I've had it with hippo launchers. <laughs> okay, here's some ultimate shoes, which are an upgrade. Whoa, which are in. Uh, goodness, a weapon for duster. Uh, but you do not need uh, to use them if you have the mystical shoes, obviously. They have such cute butts. Don't you agree? Hmm. 
Uh, let's head around. Take the long way around. Oh, good. Oh, <laughs> that's strong. Oh my gosh. Oh, goodness. Uh, let's head around. I'm not quite clear what triggers battles with these things. Grilled chicken. Okay. And what's over here? Cup of life noodles. Uh, here, you know what? I'll get rid of a secret herb in favor of the life noodles. Yeah, there we go. All right. We bring you a breaking news alert. Some idiots have been pretending to be sea monkeys in the middle of a pond. <laughs> I'm talking about you guys. Get all cover getting all covered in mud so you can fight for your lives. It's all so ridiculous. <laughs> all right then, go on to the next elevator. I think I'm gonna sit back and watch uh, even more of your stupidity in action. Come on, don't give up. You're so close to the real hundredth floor now. <laughs> hmm. Next stop, 100th floor. Hi, Mr. Frog. Uh, heading in here. Oh, goodness, you look like the oxygen tanks. How about some oxygen for old time's sake? Uh, it's okay. Oxygen! Hmm. This is a gathering room for Master Porky's fans. Can you guys put your hands to your chest and say from the bottom of your heart, I love you, Master Porky? No. Now quit looking around and get out of here. <laughs> My job is tickling Master Porky under his chins. These are Master Porky's favorite double chocolate fried pork chips. Why can't we just let Master Porky take care of everything? Your attention, please. We have a report of lost children. The detestable Lucas and his pals appear to be lost in their Master Porky's fan room. Hee hee hee. Attention, Lucas and friends. Attention, Lucas and friends. Come to the real 100th floor immediately, if you dare. <laughs> On to the next one. Next stop, 100th floor. All right, before we move any further, let's get into this instant revitalizing device. If it wasn't evident that I forgot to heal before taking on that last hippo launcher. Fully revitalized. Excellent. Hi, Mr. Frog. I actually don't need anything, including the I, including needing saving, but give my regards to nice froggy meat, but I just wanted to talk to you, because I like you. Welcome to the bathroom dungeon. Yes. Someone's in here. It's a maze of bathrooms. Ah! Alright. <laughs> this is a big mask major. Finally, we can attack these things. I am actually going to flip you around before I let anybody else hit him because Lucas is already too much probably. There's the big mass major. Finally, we can get this thing's back sprite. Get out of here. All right, great. I recommend always going in and then immediately turning around in case things uh, threatening's in here. There's an attack attractor. Um, that makes it so that enemies will attack the person that uses it. I, I don't need it. Sorry, I'm a little busy at the moment. Could you save it for later? Continuing on. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, let's beat him up. No, um, I actually wanted to get into a, I didn't even see you in here. Um, I wanted to get into a battle because I wanted to see if Trivia Card 3 works on them. Let's, uh, and I think Boney has Trivia Card 4, or is it... Or is it Duster? Who has Trivia Card 4? 
<laughs> it must be Lucas. <laughs> uh, there's so many of these, I gotta get straight. Yeah, get out of here. Come to our Red Trivia Card 3. The Big Mass answered, Wildcats. It, was, it wasn't the correct answer. Nope, nope, not at all. Nobody came. You're... <laughs> no one's gonna come for you here. Um, here, let's see uh, about Trivia Card 4. The Big Mass answered, The Civil War. It was the correct answer. Yes, Trivia Card 4 is done. Sweet. Oh, gosh. That was not very nice. All we wanted to do was play trivia. Alrighty. And Lucas is now level 66, and Duster's level 65. Oh, what do you leave? Some hot dog sushi. Um, I can throw something away for that. Uh, let's see, what does Kumatora have that I can toss? Um, the ultimate shoes, actually. Sweet, okay, cool. Nothing in there. Wait a second. This is surprisingly spick and span. Whew, made just in time. Oh, that's right, what? Whoa! Yes, it's a new enemy. This is the men's room sign. Uh, we are behind it right now, so I am actually just going to guard this turn just so that we can let it flip around to get its other side. This thing's awesome. I think this is so cool. Looks, it's, it's kind of spooky. Reminds me of old, uh, oh my gosh, this thing has Starstorm. Holy hell, I forgot about that. <laughs> uh, goodness, uh, like, get, get him out of here. Yeah, we're not playing with you anymore. <laughs> uh, reminds me of something, of, like, something that you'd find on, like, Newgrounds or something back in the day. Okay, um, Duster. Uh, we don't need the Goddess Bustier. We do need the Magic Pudding, though. What's in here? Something else. A honey shower. Interesting. I do not know what that is, honestly. <laughs> so I am going to drop this, because I don't need that anymore. And we're, whoops. Uh, going to pick this up, see what it is. Covers an enemy in honey, causing a swarm of bees to attack. That's awesome. All right. What's in here? Always just be safe. Japanese style. So thoughtful. A duck type. Whoa. <laughs> for big people. And this is for our people. What's in here? <laughs> Welcome. How good of you to visit. Wait a minute. What am I saying? This is a bathroom. What the heck is your problem? What are you doing here anyways? Oh, and a big group, no less. <laughs> uh, in here? Oh. We're friendly ghosts who used to live in the, e the easy life at Oso Castle. But some pig mass crammed us all in here the other day. I'm so sorry. Oh. Alrighty. Oh, there's uh, another pig mask uh, major. Well, how did I do that? Oh, I didn't... It's just, <laughs> goodness, I never see these things. Alrighty. Over here is the red collar. Okay. And, ah, oh man, the red collar is in here, which finally marks a an ultimate equip for Boney. Uh, we are going to drop the striped collar in favor of that. Very, very good. Now to go to the right screen. Uh, wait, I saw the black collar? <laughs> Goodness, how long have I had that? My gosh. Uh, I thought I sold it. Um, red collar. Where's the black collar? Oh, there, there it is. Goodness, that we got that in like chapter five. Wow. Or wait, was that chapter seven? Uh, well, in here is the way to go, and this is a fish. There must be something crazy going on inside this restroom, huh? Hmm. I'm jumping to flop around because I want to. Don't worry. Oh, okay. Just concerned for you, man. Uh, come on. This can't be anything too crazy. N never mind me. I'm fine here, so please go away. Uh, I'll take your word for it, actually. <laughs> Whoa! Thank God I'm such a fast runner. I made it just in the nick of time. Ahem, I'm trying to read. Look at the walls. Look at the door. What else was? What else was there to do again? Hmm. Well, it narrows down the options. Out of the way! Out of the way! Out of the way! Really narrows down the options. Hi, Mr. Frog. I do need something. I want to save here. 
Please be careful out there. Give my regards to the next frog you meet. Whoa. <laughs> okay. In here. A clean toilet is a mirror of the heart. Wipe it and polish it until it sparkles. Alright. A card that says, Out to Lunge is lying here. I'm trying to eat here. No, oh, sorry. This is the way to go. What's in here? Huh? What the? Ah! Oh my gosh! What? Oh my gosh. Ah, let me out. Uh, okay. Get in here so that you can open this and get the awesome ring. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. Um, let's... I'm going to use a luxury banana just to get it out of here. We've had a lot of these for a long time. Okay. Um, Boney, you have the awesome ring. We'll give that to Lucas. So here is an, yet another ultimate equip for Lucas. Max PP goes up by 30. That's insane. Uh, we can drop this Libra bracelet now. And uh, now we have to get out and dodge. Whoop! Excuse me. Oh, whew. Objectively the funniest dungeon. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you seem to be having quite the tough time. Did you enjoy my special all-you-can-pee toilet dungeon? Now then, I have some sad news for you. This place you're at now isn't really the hundredth floor. It's a fake. <laughs> you're nothing but a cheap toy crawling around the palm of my hand. All right, allow me to invite you to the real hundredth floor. <laughs> Board the elevator just that. I'll be waiting for you. There are signs that someone was here. There's an elevator here that goes up. Let's ride it. Next stop, 100th floor. Do you need it? Do you need something? Um, I'd like to do that. Thank you, Mr. Frog. I will give your regards. There's a wooden box here. The son of bananas wafts from it. You guys have no tact whatsoever, do you? Get out of there and get to the next elevator, and then make it to the real 100th floor. Hello, Mr. Mouse. Squeak, squeak, squeak. I don't think Locria is coming back anymore. Oh, me? I'm a mouse Locria like to dote over. He had a creepy nui -he, -he, he laugh. So he might have seemed like a mean person in most people's eyes. But he was very nice to me, at least. Do you think he'll be coming home soon? I'm so lonely. Next stop, 100th floor. Oh, 
How's everyone doing? We could use a little pick-me-up, I suppose. Had to fight some mean enemies in the bathroom. Dungeon. You're fully revitalized. Very nice. Um, how about you take all of my DP? Oh, whoops. <laughs> have I even shown depositing DP? I don't think I have. How about you help me save here, Mr. Frog? Let you do your job. Please be careful out there. Give my regards to the next frog you meet. And here are some new enemies. Whoa, oh, gosh. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. 